गुरवे शरण गुरवे शरण गुरवे शरण गुरवे शरण a young boy in a high school in one of the metropolitan cities of this country going my wayward way filling the sewers of filthy existence with my life it was at that time when in the front in front of our school we had cinema theaters and my student friends advised me that the best way to learn things of life is not in the classroom but to spend one's time within the four walls of the cinema halls. There were three cinema halls there, and I spent most of my days there. It was then that Lord Sai decided to change my life. He stepped into my life, and my life has never been the same again. One day, when we went to Brindavan, I, along with my father, 
Swami called all of us for an interview. And as all of us entered, he looked at me, patted me on my cheeks and said, Good boy. I was very happy with this because I thought it was a certificate from Swami and also that nobody knows what I really am. It was at that point that Bhagwan looked at my father and said, Where are the others? Go and call them. As he went out to call them, Bhagwan beckoned to me lovingly, looked into my eyes and said, Where were you yesterday afternoon? Well, the day before that had been a Saturday. So I, with a straight face, I said, I was in the classroom, Swami. I was at school. Since when has the classroom been shifted to the cinema theater? <laughs> and then he went on to describe the seat I had occupied, the friends I had gone with, the film I had seen, the actor, the actress. By that time, my father entered. But Bhagwan looked at him, looked at me, and I shuddered. My father was a very strict disciplinarian, and I knew that that would be a day to remember. But it has become a day to remember for a totally different reason, and that is this. Swami looked at my father, smiled at me, and said, good boy, but bad company. <laughs> and it was at that moment, brothers and sisters, I surrendered to this Lord. This Lord who could have shown his omniscience to my father and to those around him, but who chose to keep this secret that I may change, that I may transform. This is the master whom we have with us. This is the guru who has manifested for our sake. Divine love will never change at any point of time. That changeless nature. That which has no motility. That love we should run after. That is true devotion. Devotion is the synonym of love. Out of devotion, you will have so much of power. Out of this bhakti devotion, you have yukti in the method. This bhakti devotion leads to rakti, the fulfillment. This bhakti devotion leads to bhakti, rakti, 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 Krishna. Krishna. This Krishna is a lot of love. A lot of love. Many love Krishna. This Krishna is a lot of love. How many words and letters are here in Krishna? How many letters are here in Krishna? How many words and letters are here in Krishna? How many words and letters are here in Krishna? If you ask anybody in this world, they say, Krishna, the word has two letters. How many words and letters are here in Krishna? But there are five letters in Krishna. Kakaramu. Ka. Rukaramu. Ru. Hakaramu. A. Shakaramu, Akaramu, I don't know. All five letters are there. Krishna, Kakaramu, Kakara, Rukaramu, Rukara. Just see, Kakaramu is twenty. The other one is Peru. K stands for what? This Kakaramu is twenty. Ramadevi is Peru. K is the very name of Ramadevi, God's soul. Kakaramu is Ramadevi. K means Ramadevi. Rukaramu is Sita Pati. Rukara is Sita Pati. Sita. Sita. Each letter has a meaning. This Shakaramu. This Shakaramu is called Shanti. Shah stands for peace. This Akaramu. This Akaramu is called Adi Shakti. A is primal power. If you are able to do this, 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 you are able to do this. Therefore, the five senses, the five elements are there in the very word Krishna. We define Krishna as Krishna. We define Krishna as Krishna. Krishna means plowing the land. Krishna means plowing the land. Human heart, which is ploughed by God Himself. And it's very God who sows the seeds of love. And it's very God who sows the seeds of love. So we say Karshati Krishna. Karshati Krishna. Then it is said Krishna. Then it is said Krishna. And he is the one who makes all attempt in the fire. Karshati Krishna. 
ఆకర్షిత ఇది కృష్ణ అంత ఆకర్షించేటువంటి వాడు కృష్ణుడే దవన్ హూ అట్రాక్స్ ఈస్ కృష్ణ కనుక భగవత్ తత్వాన్ని అన్నింటి ఎందుకు కూడా దీన్ని పోల్చుకోవచ్చు డివినిటీ కెన్ బి వ్యూడ్ ఎవ్రీవేర్ ఈ దివ్యత్వానికి మించినటువంటిది మరొకటి లేదు దేర్ నథింగ్ అబౌ దిస్ ఈ దివ్యత్వానికి మించినటువంటి పదార్థం మరొకటి లేదు దేర్ నో అదర్ మెటీరియల్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ బియాండ్ అంత దివ్యత్వమే ఎవరీథింగ్ ఇస్ డివైన్ ఈ బట్ట దివ్యత్వమే ఈ పుష్పం దివ్యత్వమే ఈ పవన్ దివ్యత్వం అంత దివ్యత్వమే ఎవరీథింగ్ ఇస్ డివినిటీ ఏది దివ్యత్వం కాదు వాట్ ఇస్ దట్ నాట్ నిజంగా ఇది దివ్యత్వం లేకపోతే దీన్ని మనం ఎందుకు ఆశిస్తున్నాము వెన్ హౌ ఐ డు ఎక్స్పెక్ట్ డివినిటీ హియర్ ఈ బట్ట దివ్యత్వం కాకపోతే దీన్ని ఎందుకు మనం ప్రేమిస్తున్నాము వై డు యు లవ్ దిస్ క్లాత్ ఇట్ ఇస్ నాట్ డివైన్ ఎందుకు ప్రేమ తత్వం ఉంది ఎవరీథింగ్ ఇస్ డివైన్ దిస్ లవ్ దేర్ కనుక ఈ ప్రేమ తత్వాన్ని మనం అర్థం చేసుకోవడానికి తగినటువంటి కృషి చేయాలి వి షుడ్ మేక్ ఎవరీ ఎఫర్ట్ టు నో ద నేచర్ ఆఫ్ లవ్ ఈశ్వర సర్వభూతానాం అన్నింది గాడ్ డ్వెల్స్ ఇన్ ఆల్ బీయింగ్ అందరి ఎందుకు కూడాను ఈ యొక్క హృదయ సంబంధంతో ఉన్నాడు This God is located in the heart Isha, of everyone. Isha, Vasham, Midham, Jagatthu. Sarvamantha kudu ni Isha dee unnaadu. The whole cosmos is fully divine. Isha dee Sarvabhutanam. God is present in all beings. Sarvam Kalividam Brahma. Everything is divine essentially. Yekkar Tuchina Kani Brahma Sattvami. You find cosmic divine divinity Adi everywhere. Adiye Prema. Adiye Prema. That is love. Karuka mi Prema nanta kudu nu. All your love. Mi yandhi unchu konaka. Don't keep to yourself. Bhagavan Tuchina Kani Pavitra Mahit Punti Padatta Anumunu. this divine love kevalam manavulaku maatrame panchukovatam kaadu do not limit to mankind pashi pachi mrugadulu kuda nu panchali share it with birds and bees satti jeevi kuda nu ee prema tattvanni panchali you have to share it with every living being andaru kunu aikamachyam kavali we should stand united ఇది విశ్వ కుటుంబం గా రూపొందాలి ఇట్ షుడ్ బి ఎ ఫ్యామిలీ ఆఫ్ కాస్మోస్ కనుక మనకు ఏమితమైనటువంటి ద్వేషాలు కోపాలు ఈ తగాదాలు ఉండవు వి షుడ్ నాట్ గివ్ స్కోప్ ఫర్ కైండ్ ఆఫ్ కాన్ఫ్లిక్ట్ ఆర్ డిఫరెన్సెస్ ఆర్ ఎనిమిటీ ఈ నాడు లోకములో ఎక్కడ చూసినా కల్లోలములు కలహములు దీనికి కారణం ఏంటి టుడే ఇన్ ది వరల్డ్ వేర్ ఎవర్ యు గో వేర్ వాట్ ఎవర్ యు సీ యు ఫైండ్ ఎనిమిటీ మానవుని యొక్క విశాలత్వం లేకపోవడమే దీనికి మూల కారణం బికాస్ మ్యాన్ ఇస్ నాట్ బ్రాడ్ మైండెడ్ టుడే దట్ ఇస్ ద కేవలం contraction love he has contraction love not expansion love he is not expansion love vishalamaina hrudayam ledhu he is not broad minded sankuchitamaina hrudayalu pettukunnaru he is narrow minded kan aa sankuchitamaina hrudayalu manavu srushtinchukunnatundi the narrow mindedness is your making bhagavantu srushtinchetundi vishalamaina hrudayam god's creation is broad mindedness daniki inta antane parimitham ledhu it is not bound by any limitation parimitham lenatundi aparimitham infinity is limitless atti aparamitamaina tuti oka aatma tattvanni manam parimitanga pettukodam chethane manam aneka kashtamulu guri avutunnam you have put limits to this limitless spirit or conscience therefore you are in conflict prema swarupulara embodiments of love inaadu guru purnima annaru today is guru purnima guru ante emiti ni who is guru adhe cheppadu venkatramanu swat venkatraman said ro gunatitah Guru stands for attributes. Yukaro roopa varjita. Ru stands for formless. Guru atitha mene tuti di roopam lene tuti di. That which is attributeless and formless. Yukaro kevalo antakaramu. Guru stands for darkness. Yukaro tan nivarana. Ru means that dispels darkness. Antakaramu nivarana gavinchi tuti prakashame. That light that dispels darkness. 